So when I first got my dream job in Hollywood at E! Entertainment Television, I was the uh, manager of national promotion, so it was a really cool job. And I was just this kid from Boston who was suddenly in the midst of Hollywood and all the red carpet stuff. And um, I was in charge of creating what was called pre-screen entertainment. So they were like uh, things that ran before the trailers uh, with like Greg Kinnear before he was a big movie star. He used to do these promos that would produce um, for national theater chains. And it's not all that uncommon now, but back then it was pretty cutting edge stuff and it was pretty uncommon. And also back then, I would go into the editing suite and I would have, you know, uh, an engineer or a producer or both, a uh, big editing suite, thousands and thousands of dollars worth of equipment editing on things like Avid. And it was a suite. I mean, it was a big room. It looked like friggin' NASA in there. So a bit intimidating to say the least. And all this was just to record a 30 or a 60 second program. So I want to look at my notes because if I remember right, the AVID system alone was something like 40 grand. Um, and it really did look like NASA with all the screens and the whole deal. It was a little bit overwhelming. Um, but, you know, that's how we made promos. So in my case, I worked with the team to produce a video which would eventually play on the E! Network as well as on thousands of movie screens. So that was pretty cool. Uh, and it would take maybe two or three weeks to get that 60 second spot done and another couple of weeks of revisions, and another couple of weeks of approvals, corporate approvals, committee reviews, and then finally we'd get the green light and we'd be able to get the promo out there, the video out there. It was really a long, uh, tedious process to get a video done back then. And that's why I'm really excited about video today, because now we have iMovie, and on the iPad for $4.99 you can use iMovie, and shoot and edit a video in 10 minutes. Um, you've got, you know, iPhone, you can shoot a video on the iPhone, you can edit it on iMovie on the iPhone or other apps. Um, that's all you need. I'm gonna look at my notes again because I want to make sure I get this correct. So we've got like YouTube, right? Billions and billions of people can see your video in an instant. And the cool thing is that online video has really empowered the masses and made you know mass media really a mass media and it's available to anyone with an idea and a computer you don't need the big editing suite you don't need the forty thousand dollar avid system you don't need all the approvals it's just you i mean youtube's free most software is free you can edit right on youtube you can edit right on your ipad if you want um, the thought of having this kind of power and flexibility would be unimaginable even just five years ago and now it's all really right at your fingertips. Uh, there's no expensive machines, there's no editing suites, there's no corporate suits telling us what to do or what to watch, what you can make, what you can't make. Uh, it's all you, it's all yours, and uh, you have the choice to be able to create this just like we did back in the day. So I would just ask that you don't waste this incredible opportunity to uh, make your message matter and get it out there, get it out to the world. Uh, you don't have to wait for a TV network anymore. You don't have to wait for equipment. It's all at your fingertips. You are a TV network, so go do it.